merge with consolidation business date equals January 2019 a holding company is a company that owns other companies outstanding stock a holding company usually does not produce goods or services itself rather its purpose is to own shares of other companies to form a corporate group Holding companies allow the reduction of risk for the owners and can allow the ownership and control of a number of different companies. In the United States, 80% of stock, in voting and value, must be owned before tax consolidation benefits such as tax-free dividends can be claimed. That is, if Company A owns 80% or more of the stock of Company B, Company A will not pay taxes on dividends paid by Company B to its stockholders, as the payment of dividends from B to A is essentially transferring cash from one company to the other. Any other shareholders of Company B will pay the usual taxes on dividends, as they are legitimate and ordinary dividends to these shareholders. Sometimes a company intended to be a pure holding company identifies itself as such by adding «holding» or «holdings» to its name. <laughs> United States Topic banking After the financial crisis of 2007–08, many U.S. investment banks converted to holding companies. According to the Federal Financial Institutions Examination Council's FFIEC website, J.P. Morgan Chase & Co., Bank of America Corp., Citigroup Inc., Wells Fargo & Co., and Goldman Sachs Groups, Inc. were the five largest bank holding companies in the finance sector, as of 31 December 2013, based on total assets. Topic: Utilities. The Public Utility Holding Company Act of 1935 in the United States caused many energy companies to divest their subsidiary businesses. Between 1938 and 1958, the number of holding companies declined from 216 to 18. An energy law passed in 2005 removed the 1935 requirements, and has led to mergers and holding company formation among power marketing and power brokering companies. <laughs> <laughs> Broadcasting In U.S. broadcasting, many major media conglomerates have purchased smaller broadcasters outright, but have not changed the broadcast licenses to reflect this, resulting in stations that are for example, still licensed to Jacker and Citycasters, effectively making them such as subsidiary companies of their owner eHeartMedia. This is sometimes done on a per-market basis. For example, in Atlanta both WNNX and later WWWQ are licensed to WNNX Lico, Inc. Lico meaning, "...license company", both owned by Susquehanna Radio which was later sold to Cumulus Media. In determining caps to prevent excessive concentration of media ownership, all of these are attributed to the parent company, as a leased stations, as a matter of broadcast regulation. <laughs> Personal holding company In the United States, a personal holding company is defined in Section 542 of the Internal Revenue Code. A corporation is a personal holding company if both of the following requirements are met Gross income test – At least 60% of the corporation's adjusted ordinary gross income is from dividends, interest, rent, and royalties. Stock ownership test – More than 50% in value of the corporation's outstanding stock is owned by five or fewer individuals. Parent company 
A parent company is a company that owns enough voting stock in another firm subsidiary to control management and operations by influencing or electing its board of directors. A parent company could simply be a company that wholly owns another company, which is then known as a wholly owned subsidiary. When an existing company establishes a new company and keeps majority shares with itself, and invites other companies to buy minority shares, it is called a parent company. See also Berkshire Hathaway Conglomerate Conglomerate discount Kiretsu Investment company List of holding companies Patent holding company